we've already gone over multiplication by 3, but I'd like to give you another tip. When you skip count, and skip counting is, let's say you're skip counting by 3, that means you're counting by 3's. 3, 6, 9, 12. Well, one thing to get in the habit of doing that, or counting by 2's, 2, 4, 6, 8, is when you count a deck of cards, if you've got a deck of cards and you want to make sure there's all 52 are in there, you can either count them as 1, 2, 3, 4, that's nice, but it takes a little time. But you could also count 2, 4, you're pushing over 2 each time, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 52. 52 cards in this deck. Um, to make sure you're playing with a full deck, so to speak. Um, <clears throat> and naturally, you don't have to count that particular way. You can count 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. See how much faster that goes than 1, 2, 3, 4. For some reason, they always count them down on the table and they count them singly. Once you get good at pushing over two at a time, you can also start pushing over three at a time. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven, thirty, thirty-three, thirty-six, thirty-nine, forty-two, forty-five, forty-eight, and there's four more. Forty-eight and four is fifty-two. See how quick that is to count a full deck of cards?